Okay, we're up to Zion on the base. We are two lines from the top. Very, very nice Gemara. Very, and uh, tomorrow morning, Bez Hashem, Daf will be at 9 a.m. Daf will be tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. on Zoom. The shul is busy, but uh, so it'll be on 9 a.m. in the morning. I'll put it out on the chat. Tan Rabbanan. Be'echad benisin, Rosh Hashanah lechadashim, uli iburim, uli chumashkalim, in other words, in our Mishnah, we had a whole list. We have a brisa that adds things on the list that we didn't have in our Mishnah. First and foremost, we have Chadashim, right? Rosh Chodesh Nisan is the first month of the year. When, we, when the, the Torah counts months, the first month, Rishon Chodesh or Rishon, it's Nisan. And we're going to have a limit for it. Uli Burim, the Gemara's half amina is that every Time you make a leap year, you do it in Nisan. The Gemara is going to ask, that's not true. Third, that you separate Shkalim to bring the new Kabanis in Nisan, which is true. That in scenarios where you go ahead and rent a house, could be if you rent a house 30 days before Nisan, the year is up in Nisan. 30 days before Nisan, the year would be up in Nisan. Okay, that's the that's the Yesh Omer. Gemara now will go through all the places. We we'll go through each and every place of these fully mudim. So the first one, lechadashim. Nisan is Rosh Chodesh of the months. It's the it's, it's Rosh Hashanah of the months. The first month. Minalon. Where do you know it from? Now it's fascinating. I always thought you know it from the Torah, and we're going to see you only know it from Kabbalah. You only don't know, know it from the Nevi'im. From the Torah itself, we would know it. Why does it say in the Torah? It says Hachodesh Hazel Lochem Rosh Chodeshim. So HaKadosh Baruch Hu takes Aaron and Moshe and Parshas Bo, he shows them the moon, and he says, Reish and This is Reish Chodesh. When you see the moon like this, The first month of the Chodesh Hashanah. On the 10th day of this month, A person should take a set to his house, and they should watch it, Ad arba asa yoyim the chaydesh hazeh till the fourteenth day of this month the shach the so so this is Shabbos agadol you're going to tie it to the bed from the tenth day to the fourteenth day and you're going to be in the karim pesach so we all know this is a nisan now why does it say hachaydesh hazeh lachem reish chadashim rishon hu lachem lechad sheyashana that's what it says uksev shomer es hachaydesh aviv watch the chaydesh aviv again not telling us a, a particular month. Which is the chodesh that has ripened fruit in it? When it ripens, uh, the, the fruit, uh, the produce begins. To, the produce begins to ripen in Nisan. The karele rishain, and we call it rishain. So therefore, putting it together, shamers a chodesh aviv azeh, and it says a chodesh rishain. So the chodesh aviv of ripeness, and it says chodesh. So the chodesh rishain must be Nisan. It ripens in ER also. It ripens in ER as well. So let's say it's what it's ER. And for the Gemara, being in Aviv Aleka, you need ripening or not. And I guess in ER, it doesn't matter. It's, it's, it's ripe already. The Ema Adar says, being in Roiv Aviv, you need the majority of ripe fruits. And that's the minority of ripe fruit. Aleka, Fred the Gemara, Midi Roiv Aviv, Kasiv, does it say Roiv Aviv? So now there's like three choices. Everyone agrees that the produce ripens in Nisan. The one that ripens earlier ripens in Adar. The one that ripens later ripens in, in New York. So it could be any one of those three. Well, we, we don't like the last one because it's we're speaking about when what, when, when, when the, it ripens and already is ripened in ER. So Adar also ripens. I, it's a minority. It's a minority. We want Roiv. Vu state Roiv. It doesn't say Roiv. For that reason, we don't have a Raya from this this source that Nisan is the first month. So we're going to go through a, a few Makomas in the Torah and reject each one because of the questions. And then we're going to have to come on to Divrei Nevi'im. El Amr Av Chista Mehacha Ach Bechamisha Asa Yom Lachaydesh On the 15th day of the month Hashvi, right, this is speaking about in the 15th day of the 7th month, Lachaydesh Hashvi Vi Os Bechem Es Tfu Asa Aretz When you go ahead and grab your grain. So this is speaking in Sukkis. Eizachoydesh yesh ba'asifa, habiyam ezet tishrei, v'kakar v'leishvi, 
So you count from Quebec seven months, you're going to get Nisan. So you see that Nisan is the first month. So we tried to get Nisan directly, we couldn't. So let's go ahead and, 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 and use an indirect way. If Sukkot is in Tishrei, and this is the seventh month, and Tishrei is the seventh month, it must be Nisan is the first month. Being an Asif Aleka, Marcheshvin already it's been gathered in all the produce. The Ema Elo, and people start beginning gathering in an Elo. Umay Shvi Shvi La Adar, the seventh month after Adar. Being in Roivas of Asif, you need your most of your gathering, which takes place in Tishrei. The Leka, for everyone, Midi Roiva Asif Kasif, just like we rejected above Roiv Aviv, the Roiv of the ripening, so too we can check the, reject over here Roiv Asif, the Roiv of the harvesting. So Lechaira, you don't have a source. Neither one of this is a, is a proper source for ascertaining that what that the first month of the year is what is Nisan. El Ravina, listen to this. This we will not know from Paris Moshe. We learn it from the Rekabala, we learn it from the Navi. The only way you know that the first month of the year is Nisan, we know from the Navi. What does it say in Zechariah? In the 24th day, to the 11th month, which is Shvat. So you count back. If, 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 if Shvat is the 11th month, Adar is the 12th month, and Nisan is the first month. I don't learn it from Zechariah, but I learn it from Esther. Esther was taken to the Melech Achashverosh, El Beis Malchusoy, Vachoydesh Asiri, right? On the tenth month, Chaydish Teves, which is the Chaydish of Teves. So Teves is the tenth month, and Nisan is the first month. Rav Kaanam Amihacha, be Arbo le Chaydish at Shi, on the fourth day of the, right, of the ninth month, the Kislev, which is Kislev. Rav Acha be Yaakov Amihacha, be Yikru Seifi Amelech, be Esahi, be Chaydish at Shlishi, who Chaydish Sivan. Again, this is from Esther. Rav Ashi Amihacha, Hippil Pur, who are Goru Lufne Haman. So it said, all points to Nisan being the, uh, the first month. So the Kashir is the that says it openly, right? So why did you have to have all the other ones from Zechari and this? It says it openly over here. It says, why don't you, why don't you, it says, 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 why didn't everyone say from this one? Because that's that that's the source we want. We want one. It says we're dealing with my rishon, rishon the mill sake. In other words, guys, the chaydish rishon. It could be the first month after hippel pur. It could be at the first month after adar, where when he. In other words, rishon does say it's the first month. It says we're we're assuming rishon. It's the first month. Maybe it's the first month to Haman's plan, which was cast in adar, and therefore it's the first month after that. Therefore, all the other people did not like that as a possibility. The Tana done the Shnai question. Why didn't our Tana include right, uh, that Nisan is the first month? Right? Why didn't he include this? This is only in the Brisa. The Tana done the Shonim Kamari Bechadoshim like Kamari. He's speaking about years, we're not speaking about, about Chadoshim. Now, I find it fascinating that in the Torah, nowhere does it say Nisan, Ia, Sivan, Tammuz, right? None of that. The Torah, where does that all come from? Where does that all come from? So this is all Dibri Kabbalah. This is how you look at Taisvis, guys. Look at Taisvis. Midibri Kabbalah Lamadnu, Laimatsi Lamelef Mikan Minayu, Klau, and Lay Nomar. We wouldn't be able to learn it if that if not that it said it, Shoisa Kabbalah Biyadam. They had a Kabbalah in their hands. Say the Shemus Hakadoshim. There was a Kabbalah, the order of the names of the month. Ze Achaze, one after the other. But Haki Omibi Yushami. This is what it says in Yushami. Guys, this is what they used to call it. Shemus Chadashim Alu Biyada Mi Bavel. The names of the Chadashim they brought back from Bavel. Until Gullis Bavel, guys, and they, they didn't have any calendars until Gullis Bavel. There was no, there was no Nisan, Iyar, Sivan, none of that. Until Gullis Bavel, after the Churban Bias, only then did they begin having the names. For example, Bishoyna, they used to call it the Yerech Esonim. They called it the Yerech of Esonim, Avram Esan. Sheboy Noldo Avais. That's when the Avis were born. In in what? In they called the uh, I guess Tishrei. Biyerech bull. They called Yerech bull. That's the second month, Marcheshvin. 
Shekol Oilam Noivel, Voritz Oisa Boilis Boilis. Again, the the land got lot. I guess it, it was drowned out. I think I don't know exactly what Boilis means, but I think that's that that's what it means. Be'erich Ziv Sheboy Ziv Oilanois. We come to Elech by Yibe Chodesh Nisan Shnas Esim. So in other words, Tosis tells us that they got their names in Babel, and until Babel, they didn't use them. So it's fascinating. That's 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 where it came from. There is a Ramban. The Ramban is found in Shmos, Perik Yud Beis. You want a source, guys. A good Maramakan. Shmos Yud Beis, Pasik Beis. And this is what the Lashen of, of the Ramban is. Initially, they didn't have names. The Chadashim didn't have names. This is on the Pasik. This is on the Pasik. Why did they have names? They used to count Zechel Yitzhiyas Mitzrayim. They used to count going out of Mitzrayim. In other words, how many months from Yitzhiyas Mitzrayim? They would count. And that's they would know, because they know when they went out of Mitzrayim. Aval Kasher Aleinu mi Bavel. When they went up to Bavel, v'niskayim asha osa akosav, they mekayim the pasuk in Yermia, v'lo yi omar oid. They won't say anymore, chay Hashem, Hashem should live, asher hela espenei Yisrael me Eretz Mitzrayim, ki im chay Hashem, asher hela espenei Yisrael me Eretz Tzofen. Chay Hashem, the one who brought us out of Eretz Tzofen. Which is Bavel. So therefore, since they brought us that we, the Navi tells us no longer will we say Chay Hashem brought her out of Mitzrayim, but Chay Hashem brought us from Bavel, then they brought back the Chadashim from Bavel. Because again, you're going back to that date. You're going back to not the not the Yitzhiyas Mitzrayim. You're going back to the salvation for Bavel. And in Bavel, they had these names. So that, that's the source for what for, for the for the for the Chadashim. It's fascinating. We're good? Okay. Says the Gemara Vaita, Ulei Burim. Now we said that Rosh Chodesh Nisan is is the is Rosh Hashanah Lei Burim. The implication is that on you once you get to the implication is once you get to Nisan, then you make an Ibiyar. But you all know, guys, we make an Ibiyar in Adar, right? So the Gemara has to answer up. Fred Gemara Kasha, Ulei Burim. The Iburin mean Nisan Maninon? You tell him we're going to go ahead and count it from Nisan? But Tanya, Ein Ma'abim Hashana, Lifnei Rosh Hashana. Let's say you can ascertain, and we all know this year, when Rosh Hashana falls out very, very early, you know it's an Ibiyah, right? You know it's an Ibiyah, for sure. So why don't they go ahead, in the old days, why did they make an Ibiyah before? Because by the time they get to Adar, maybe they'll forget. If they do go ahead and, and declare Bezdin declares an Ibiyar before Rosh Hashanah, the year is not, not an Ibiyar, not a leap year. Let's say they were worried about Shmad or Bezdin will be out of town. Then Ma'abrinai said the Acha Rosh Hashanah, Miyad. Immediately after Rosh Hashanah, they would make it. Okay, so far no Kasha. The Alpha Pekane, even though they would make an Ibiyar as early as right after Rosh Hashanah, Tishrei, Ein Ma'abin El Ada. The only month that you make an Ibar is Adar. So that's the Kasha. The Bryce is Mashma, the month you make an Ibiyar is Nisan. Here we say, this is a Gemara in Sanhedrin that we just quoted. We say that what? That even in the scenario, for whatever reason, you're going to make an Ibiyar, declare an Ibiyar. In post Tishrei, post Rosh Hashanah, the only month that would be an Ibar would be Adar, Kasha on the Brisa. So, Ella, so Amar of Nachman by Yitzchak, my Iburin, have Sakas Iburin. It means you can't make an Ibar. Once you get to Rosh Chaydish, Nisan, it's Rosh Hashanah Iburin, meaning you can't make an Ibar. Up until then, you would be able to. Up until Nisan, you would be able to. But once you get Nisan, there's no way of going back. That's it. You can't make a Nibir. It's too late. Did not. We learned in the Mishnah. Heine Idu, Rabbi Yeshua and Rabbi Papayas, Shema Abin Ashana Kol Adar, that they made an Ibr Ashana the whole month of Adar, meaning not just, bef- not just up until Purim, but the whole Purim, as we're going to see. Shahoyu Oimim Ara Purim. There were those who said you can only make an Iber up to the, the 14th or 15th day of, of Purim. My timer, the man the Amara Purim, Kivin the Amamar, 
Shoylem bihilchas a pesach koydim le pesach shloishim yoyim. Since they said you have to start eating, of, start teaching the laws of pesach thirty days before, so the fifteenth day would be thirty days before. Asi lezuze bechametz. If you're going to go ahead and make an ibiya post that, people in mezazel they won't believe it. One second. 30 days before you, you, you're going ahead and teaching us about Pesach, it can't be that this is in the every year. And you can make country mezalzel with chametz if you keep it later. So make so the idach, and the one who says you could make it post, made the idea, everyone knows, the shosim avrasa, the chushbana talen mosa, that an every depends upon the mathematics. The sabri chushbana hudloi solik lu rabbanon, ada idna, the chacham did not get the mathematics correct until post purim. The time of the idon, uh, so very good. So, so in other words, what we see from here, all we prove from here, that 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 you can't once you get a Nissan, you're finished. That's it. Now, our Tana did not include our Tana did not include Shonim because he was speaking about he wasn't speaking about he was only speaking about years. He wasn't speaking about months. Why didn't he include Iber? Why didn't he include the this as part of his four? Why does the Bryce include it and not him? And for the Gemara, Bahaschalus Kamari, Bahaschalus like Kamari. It's be- speaking about the beginnings of something, not the end of something. What are you telling? What does Ibr mean? That Rosh Chodesh Nisan, you can't. The, all hours, everything, Malachim, Shonim, everything, Elo, that's the beginning of something. Rosh Chodesh, Ibor is the end of something. Nisan is the end of something. Therefore, the Artana did not include it. The next thing in the Brisa was Chumash Shkalem. Okay, let's just go back in time. We said, Back in time to Masech the Shkalim, that we said that Veshchoidish Adar, that the Shluchim would go out, they would announce and start co- and collecting, sh- people would, they would start collecting, and people would send in the Shkalim because when came to Veshchoidish Nisan, they have to go ahead and take the funds that were collected to buy Kurbanis from the new funds. It has to be so Veshchoidish Nisan, which is Rosh Hashanah, the Chumas Shkalim, the separation of the Shkalim, the gift of the Shkalim that you're going to bring now from the new coins. Not the old coins, right? That was a basic idea. Says the Gemara. Minola, Amrabi Aishia, Amakra, Zois Oilas Chodesh Bichotshoi Lechatshia Shanos. You got a lot of, you got an extra Chodshay there. Zois Oilas Chodesh Bichotshoi Lechatshia Shana. Amit Torah, the Torah says, Chodesh, the Hava Karb, Torah says Chodesh, the Habab Karb Mitchumas Chadasha. The Gemiri, Shana Shana Minisit. And we learn Shana Shana from Nisan. So now it's important to note in both these Psukim, it mentions the word Chaydesh and the word Shana. Take a look again. And now it says, So it mentions both the word Chaydesh and both the word Shana. So we learn out. We learn out one from the other. So just like over there, is Nisan, as we ascertain. So too, Chumas Alishka is is what is Chumas Hashkalim uh, is what is in in uh, Nisan. Furthermore, learn out Shana Shana from Tishrei. The Chesiv Meirishis Hashana. Notice, guys, by by Tishrei, it does not say the word Chodesh, just as the word Shana. So, and for the Gemara, the obvious answer, which is more comparable, Nisan, where it says Chodesh and, and, and Shana, or or Tishrei, where it only says Shana. Says, I'd rather learn the word Shana that has the word Chodesh with it. So I learn that Shkalim from Nisan, right? Because Tishrei just as the word Shana, it doesn't say what Chodesh. Uh, it's a mitzvah to go ahead and bring it out from the the chadash, from the new chadash, from the new coins. The mehevi min ayashan. If you bring it from the old coins, yatsa el shachisa mitzvah. You're missing a mitzvah. In other words, you would be yatsa. You're just missing a mitzvah. Tanya nami hachi to the words of Shmuel. Kabanas sibar haboyim beachah benisan the communal carbon that you bring on echad mitzvah mehevi min achadash. It's a mitzvah to bring it from the new coins. The mehevi min ayashan. If you bring it from the old coins, yatsa el shachisa mitzvah. The yachid shes nadei mishaloi, and a yachid who makes a nether to go ahead and give from his, a yachid who makes a nether to give from his own coins, meaning not coins, his own animal, right? But it's for a carbon seabor, ksherim, and bulvachi mustim the seabor, he has to give it over to the seabor. 
So in other words, if, a, if he gives over an animal to the tzibur, it's also good. Pshita, why, why would you think it's not good? So Madatema Lechesh Shema Loyim Sermenu Litsiba Yafa Yafa. I might think that why he won't give it over to the Tsibur well, meaning he won't give it over Belay Shalim, Kamash Malan. Kamash Malan that what that he does. Kamash Malan that he does. Just one second. The Tana did done, our Tana, why did it include Chumas Shkalim? Kim the Tanium Havi Yatza. In other words, he, the Tanakam wants to learn something that's absolute. This is this and only this. But you just told me Trumas, you're supposed to bring it, and it's a mitzvah to bring, but if you don't, you so that's not absolute. He's only absolute, this is it. This, this is this. Echa is not absolute because you would be yoitsa bringing the old ones. I saw a nice Peshat, but name the issue, what's the name of the, 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 the Seifa? The safe is called Truas Melech. The safe is called Truas Melech. This is quoted by, I have a safe here from Yitzhak Zil, uh, Michal Zilba. What does it mean when, if the guy is giving the carbon, why don't you think he's giving it over? <laughs> why, if he's not having use from it, right? He's giving it over to the base of Migdash for a carbon seabird. Why you be chayish that he's not giving it well? What's, obviously, he must be giving it well. He's giving, a guy gives tzedakah. He's not getting uses from it. Guys, what are you chayish for? Guys, you hear, it doesn't make any sense. When you don't give something, I'm, I'm giving it over to the tzibah as a carbon tzibah, right? So why in the world would you think I'm not giving it as a carbon tzibah? I'm not giving it well. Why would you think? So the same, same with the true smell says the Gaval Gimshat. He says the following. When you give it over for the tzibah, it doesn't go directly from you to the tzibah. In order to be the tzibur, it has to be you make the tzibur shliach for you. In other words, it's not your, it's a, sh- a carbon tzibur has to be brought from the tzibur. So your kavona has to be, as the kav- your kavona has to be that it should be Michel tzibur. So when not chayish, he doesn't give it over. Where chayish, he gave it over like with the wrong machshava, as if he's giving from himself. He really has to make the shliach, the, the, the tzibur shluchim to bring it as a carbon tzibur. So we're not chayish, he's not giving it. We're not with chayish, the kavana that he needs won't be there, which is to make the shliach, the, the tzibur shliach to bring it rather than directly from him, which is an easy mistake to make because I would think I'm giving it, it's for me, you know, I'm giving a donation, I want my name on the wall, right? You know, no, it's not. It has to be, you're giving it to the tzibur and you're being mamana the tzibur as a shliach. That's, that's what the Shuma Samelov says, Shuma Samelov says. The Yeshayim Rafa Schirs bought him, there was a fourth pshat, a fourth shot in, in Russia and in, in Nisan being Rosh Hashanah for renting houses. This is for, for all, all landlords out there. Tanrabana. Hamascha bayis lechaveroi lishana. If someone rents a house for a friend from a, for a year, it's, it means a year, 365 days from day, day, year, day to day. I, I, I know I said 365, it could be 354, I'm not sure. Vim Omar Lishana Zu, I probably 354. Vim Omar Lishana Zu, and if he says this year, Vim Omar Lishana Zu, I feel like Omar Ella the Echo the Adar. Since he even 30 days before Reshkadish Nissan on Reshkadish Adar, Kiman Shegia Yoim Echo the Nissan, also Lishana. That's it. That's it. Because he said, I'm renting it for this year. So that's what it means that Echo the Nissan. If you say for this year, Nisan's the cutoff point. If you say Stam Shana, then you go from 12 months. If you have, however, say Shana Zu, just like Nisan was the cutoff point for Malachim, so that, that, that they started rain, so too the year of the rental is over. And even if it's now, why not, if the year is over, why not Chav Test? Because the person's not going to rent for less than 30 days. That we'd say, person won't rent for less than 30 days. And even according to the manuscript, says that one day in the year is considered a year. We saw that by the kings, right? The king is anointed in the Chavtes. When it comes to Rish Chaydish, we count as the second year of his reign. Shiny Hoch, it's stiffened by a rental. 
And a person is not going to go ahead and rent for less than 30 days. Okay, so that's the din of schiris of, of, uh, of a house. Let's say Tishrei. Again, two big months that Stamas Lei Rosh Hashanah might be would be Tishrei or Nisan. You tell me it's Nisan, why not, why not Tishrei? And say that the year is up in Tishrei. It says, where Stam Ki Ogur Inish Pesa. A person is not going to rent up to Tishrei. Why? Because Tishrei begins the rainy season. It's not a guy's going to rent for the whole rainy season. Fred the Gemara of Tanakhama, the Brisa that only considered Chadoshim and Ibur and and Schir, and and, uh, and Trumas Shkalim. Why did he consider Schiris Abatim? And the Tana of Amishna, the Tana Didon. Why did he not consider Schiris Abatim? It says Benisanami Mishka Shichi Kitri. In, in, in Nisan also, it's shaykh to have what? Clouds and rain. And therefore, a person will not go ahead and end his schiris in Nisan because, again, the same problem you're going to have in Tishrei of the rainy season, you might have in, in, in Nisan also. Therefore, we didn't consider it in our Mishnah, nor did the time of the Baisa. Okay, let's go back to our Mishnah. Can you imagine your eight plot in on the opening Mishnah, and which will continue for quite a while? We did, let's go over the Mishnah again. We said that was for Jewish kings, and that was to ascertain what year in, in Shtarois, to know when a star that it should not be predated, right? The reign of the king. We said it was according to Rev Shimon that you need Kiseder, Pesach, Shuas, Sukkis in order to be over Balta Acher. Now, this is where we're up to. The first day of Elul is Rosh Hashanah al Maisa Behema. So we have machloikis exactly when Rosh Hashanah Maisa Behema. Let me just uh, go ahead and 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 jar your memories. Maisa Behema is you go ahead, you put animals in the flock. Every tenth one that comes out, you hit with a stick with red paint, and that's Maisa Behema. It's a carbon. Now you can't take from the Chodesh and the Yashan. What's the cutoff point that they're considered part of one cohort, one of one year, and the other one that's machloikis. Right, we have Machlokes between the, that Echa Be'elul. We have that Echa Be'elul, the Tanakama, which who we we'll see is Reb Meir in a second, and Reb Eliezer and Reb Reb Elazar, Reb Shimon, who says it's Be'echad Be Tishrei, either El or Tishrei. Good, and that's Rosh Hashanah. Now, where do they get the sources from? The Echa Be'elul, Rosh Hashanah, Ma'aseh Behema, money. Who is the Tana who says Be'echa Be'elul? It's Reb Meir. He, it's Reb Meir. The Tan, the Tanan, we learned in the Mishnah, the Mishnah Bechayris, Reb Meir Oimer. Good. All right, guys, go back to the Mishnah. I, 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 think, I just think this is the best way to learn. Go back to the opening Mishnah. Abba Rosh Hashanah Heim. Be'echa be'nisan Rosh Hashanah Malachim. Ula Regalim. What was Regalim, guys? It was Baal Ta'acher. According to who? Rev Shimon, Rev Shimon by Yechoi. We had five sheets in Baal Ta'achad. Tanakhama said any three months. Rev Shimon by Yechoi said what? It has to be Nisan is the first, right? And therefore, Be'echad be Nisan, Regolim, this is according to Rev Shimon. Good. Continue. Be'echad be'el, Rosh Hashanah l'maysa behema. This is Rev Meir, correct? So you went from Rev Shimon to Rev Meir. Rev Lezer, Rev Shimon, I mean Be'echad be'tishrei. We know we, we need a certain symmetry in the Mishnah. What do you just do? You went to, well, guys, you went to Rav Shimon, Rav Meir, Rav Shimon, back in the Gemara, not back by us. Money, Rav Meir, he did not, did not, Rav Meir, Aymer, Be'echa Be'el, Rosh Hashanah, L'maysa Be'hema. Be'echa Be'el, Rosh Hashanah, L'maysa Be'hema. Ul Regalim, money, who is the Tanad of Baal Ta'acher that you need starting with Nisan? It's Rav Shimon, he. Aymer Seifer, Rav Lezer, Rav Shimon, Aymer, Be'echa Be'tishrei. Rav Rosh Hashanah, Le... Maisa Behema is Tishrei. Reisha Besef Reb Shimon Mitzyasa Reb Meya. What kind of symmetry is that? Am Reb Yosef Rebbe he. It's according to Rebbe. Venasa la libo de Tanoi, and he's learned it's Rebbe. The Mishnah is Rebbe, and he was going according to various Tanoim. The Ragolim Savala Reb Shimon. When it comes to Baal Ta'acher, he holds like Reb Shimon. Who Maisa Behema Savala Reb Meya. So the Chayra, there's your symmetry. Ihachi, if you're telling me it's one opinion, guys, you got a problem. Arba chamisha have. If you say it's what, it's one person, it's not four, it's five. Let's see Rashi. 
Ihachi. Go up a little bit. Ihachi. The Chad Gavra Amal Nisan. That only one person said the Mishnah. Vinasav Milsei. Chada Kichad Hana. Then Chamisha Rosh Hashanah Ninu. You have five Rosh Hashanahs. Echad Ben Nisan, guys. What's Echad Ben Nisan? That's Rosh Chodesh Lamalachim. Tesvav Ben Nisan. That's Rosh Hashanah Lamaisa Behema. Ah, to 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 Bal Ta'acher. Ve'echa be'elol is Maisa Behema. Ve'echa be'tishrei is is uh, we're going to see for Yerakos and everything else. Yoyvloys Shmita. Utesva b'shvat two b'shvat. I I got five now. Ha nicha imi took maslola reisha kriv shimin shapir. If you can say it's a kriv shimin, it would work out well. The leidei arbanino. It's only four. The less they echa be'elol because you can deduct echa be'elol because he says echa be'tishrei. El ichat tana amisa kasha. If you're going to say it's according to one tana, you got a problem. Guys, you have a problem. You have echa betishrei from alachim. You got regolim, which is what is 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 is, is bal ta'acher. Then you have, then you have echa uh, be'elo, which is what ma'isa behema. Then you have echa betishrei, which is for yovel. And then you have two bishvat. That's five. That's five. You got a problem. It's very gishmak. Says the Gemara. Yehachi, if you're telling me it's one Tana, Arba Chamisha Havi. Amarava, here's what you have to say. Arba Ledivri Akol, right? Arba Ledivri, Arba is Ledivri Akol. Lered Meya Arba, right? So Arba Ledivri Akol. Lered Meya Arba, why? Dal Regolim, because take out Regolim. Guys, very gishmak. Lered Meya was the one who said one month. Going back over, I'll draw your memory. We had five shittas. Tanakama, three or three. Reb, Rebbe Shimon, who said three kaseder, so it could be four or four or five. Reb Meya, who said one. So obviously, like Reb Meya, Reish Chodesh Regalim is out. So therefore, you have four. Right? Dal Regalim, Reb Shimon, Arba, Reb Shimon's four, because Dal Maisa Behema, because he doesn't have he doesn't have Rosh Chodesh El, he has Rosh Chodesh Tishrei, so it comes out very good. Four, there's four according to everybody, according to me, but there's four according to everybody else. Rav Nachman Yitzchak Amar Arba Chadashim, there are four months. Ubahem Kama Rosh Hashanah, there are four months, and in those four months you have a bunch, so the number four stays the same. Meisibe, I'll ask you both on Rava. Who said for the Deviakol and Machmu said you go after months? Shisha Asa Benisan, Rosh Hashanah Loimer. The sixth day of Nisan is Rosh Hashanah Loimer because you're going to be in the carbon Oimer from barley. Shisha Besivin, the sixth day of Sivin, which is, is what, of course, is, is uh, Shuis, Rosh Hashanah Lashte Lechem. That's going to matter the Chadash and the Beis Amigdash, it's brought from wheat. Le Rava Lisni Shisha, Le Rava, you should learn six. And Le Rav Nachman by Yitzhak Lisni Chamisha, you should learn what? Okay, let Rava Arba Ledivri Akol. Let Rashi does the cheshbon for us. Let's see. Let's let's see Rashi. Le Rava, go down a little bit. Le Rava the Amar Arba Ledivri Akol listi Masnisan Shisa. You should learn what two more. The, write these two. And Le Rav Nachman the Amar Chadashim Kachashiv Nisni Hey the Halay Tran Sivin Be Masnisan. Guys, you'd have this. You'd have five, right? You'd have Tishrei. You'd have Elo. You have uh, two bishvat, and you would have uh, Nisan, and you'd have Sivan. So list five according to him. And according to Rabba, since you're Divya Kol, you're giving the Chesh Bainis. So go ahead and list two more. List the uh, 16th day of Sivan as number five, and the, the 16th day of, of, like I said, of Nisan is five, and the 6th day of Sivan has six. What do you do with that? What, that's the Kasha. And for the Gemara and Rapapa, Kika Chashev Midi the Chayel Me Orta. Only things that happen in the evening. Midi the Lechal Be Orta Leka Chashev. Both the Oimer and the Shnei Lechem are brought during the day. So we're only considering Rosh Chodesh that begins the night before. Therefore, you won't include these two. That's the Territ of Rapapa. Fred the Gemara, the Hari Regolim Lechal Me Orta. The guys only during the day and not at night. Yeah? And you're considering it. Guys, when did Baal Ta'acha start? 
long time ago. <laughs> long time ago, right? Since you had to bring it before. No, but here's the kasha. Guys, look at me. Guys, look at me. Here's the kasha. The reason we didn't consider the, the Oimer and the reason we didn't consider the Shtelechem they brought during the day. Baal Ta'achi is on a carbon. It's also during the day. Fans of the Gemara, good Baal Ta'achi can only be brought up in the day, but you started it a long time ago when you didn't bring it in the first place. So that's his answer. Kimish the Tzorach Lassui Meikara Mechayev. The koi, your mom is mechayev the koi. You you mechayev to bring it. So in Mela, it's not that that it's only brought during the day is not not a consideration since you you started from before. Fred the Gemara, if your question if your answer is good, the reason why they considered we don't consider the carbon oimer and the carbon of the shtei lechem the kibbutz yad seres is because they brought during the day and only considered nighttime. But yoyvlois the lechal miorta yoyvlois is not chal miorta v'kachashiv. When does yoyvlois start? When you read on the on Yom Kippur, where you blow the horn, that's during the day. And yet we said that uh, tish, uh, that Yud Tishrei is what is in Tish is what is is Rosh Hashanah Liyavos. No, we didn't. We didn't say. Says Gemara, Rabbi Shmuel ben Yisrael Biachin and Brayke. He Domar may Rosh Hashanah Chayal Yavo. We're going to see that the blowing of the Shaifa was to free the slaves totally, but the Etzim Yavo, the Halachas Yavo, begin on Rosh Hashanah. So that began right at night. So the mail is very gishmak. Your cash is not a kasha. So so far we held serve to, to go ahead and answer why we don't consider the oimer and shtelechem as what as part of our four in the Mishnah. Says the Gemara, Reb Shisha Brei the Reb Idi Amar Kika another teretz. Why do we consider these two? Kika chashiv midi de leitoli b'maisa midi de toli b'maisa like a chashiv. So a puppet's teretz is evening, and Reb Reb uh, Reb Idi bar Oven's teretz. Rav Shish, Rav 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 his teretz is something that doesn't depend upon a Misa, something that happens automatically. So Rosh Hashanah of, of Oimer depends upon the bringing of the Oimer. Rosh Hashanah of Kifsi Yatzeres depends on the Misa of Kifsi Yatzeres. Anything listed in our Mishnah had nothing to do with a Misa. It simply happened in the Mela. So two Turutsam, Rav Papa, evening, Rav Shish, Rav Vidi, Misa. Fred Gemara, Guys, when are you over Baltacha by not bringing a carbon, right? That's a mice, isn't it? Right? It's not, right? It, it, it's you're not bringing a carbon. And for the Gemara, Baltacha and Melechail, right? When soon, as soon as the day comes, it's as soon as the regal, here's the half amino. Guys, you're in the third, third regal, right? As soon as the morning hits, you still have time that day to bring it. The answer is no, you're over in the morning, even before. So it's not Tali B'maisa, it's Tali Wad Memela. Fred the Gemara Yoivol, right? That blowing the Shaifa, blowing the Shaifa, it, it you know, goes ahead and brings it out. So the answer is, right? That's, it, it's, it's according to Rishmal, who says it starts in Rosh Hashanah, that even before you blow the, 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 the Shaifa, it happens in Mela. So, so far, Rav Sheshi Bradidi held serve. We have two Terutzen. A pup is Teretz. Why don't we include Sivin and, and, and uh, Nisan of the 16th and the 6th uh, accordingly? It's because it was Tali in the evening, and, and that was, these are both during the day. And Rav Sheshi Bradidi was Tali Wad in Misa, and these, these, that was Tali by Misa. Ravashi gives it different Teretz. Ravashi, Amar, Ravashi says, He's not come. He's. I think he's giving me the Ravashi Yama Arba Rosh Hashanah. Heim. He's giving. He's coming to answer. Not. I think he's coming to answer the original. Look at Rashi. Ravashi Yama High Delay Choshev Mas Nisan Ella Arba. Why am I only a four? The fish like Mona Ella Rosh Hashanim Haboyim Berosh Hashadoshim. The Ain Regolim Min Aminyan, and Regolim doesn't count. Ella Kedar Minan Regal Sheboy. The Regal. The the. Rosh Hashanah Nisan, meaning the regal that's in Nisan, but we're not counting as, as, as what is Tesvav. So that would take care of anything that's not what on Rosh Hashanah itself, the Rosh Chodesh itself. Arba Rosh Hashanah Heim, Shehim Ba Arba Rosh Hashanah, the four Rosh Hashanah that come out on Rosh Chodesh. All right, good, good. We're only considering, so therefore, we won't consider Tesvav. Nisin, Tezayin Nisin, we won't consider what? We won't consider, we won't consider Vav Sivin, and we won't, and Regolim 
How he's learning Pshat and Regolim, I Baal Tach is only on the Yontif, and Yontif is 15. So he's learning the month that the Regal falls out in. The, when does, according to Rav Shimon, the, is Baal Tach had start, Biragolim on Tezvav, and Nisan, that's the month that, well, that it falls out in. That's how he's learning. Fred Gemara, Echa Bishvat Kibbe Shamai. Guys, the end of the Mishnah. When's Rosh, Rosh Hashanah Leilano? Says be shamay mishchaytish. Says be sil on on two on, on two bishvat as vav. So comes that Ravashi is, is going according to be shamay. I the Gemara in Erev and Yigimel tells us that Allah is always like be sil. So how could Ravashi give this teretz according to be shamay? So no, the Gemara with Avunda echa bishvat ke be shamay. And for the Gemara how come on shloi shul adiri akol three everyone agrees with three everyone agrees with uh, right Nissan and Tishrei and and and. This in Tishrei and what's the other one? Everyone gives me. Yeah, I was bothered by Rashi's bother with my question. Look at Rashi. Shlesh the Divya call, Lav Dafka three. The Echa Be'el Nami Plukta. Echa Be'el is also also a Machlaikis. The Rebbe Lezer of Shimon Oimim. Echa Betishrei Ela Beis Hilukoi. It's going Beis Hilukoi. Okay, I, again, they make any sense to me, right? We had Nisan and Tishrei. You have to call Elul. So it's Lav Dafka three. But anyway, Hachem Shloish Le Derbi Akol and Be Echa Beshvat Machloikus Beis Shamim Beis Hilukoi. Echa Beshvat Machloikus. So therefore, you have three ways to answer it. Either the more, either evenings we didn't count Rapapa or Shish Bavidi. That we don't count Maisa or Ravashi. We're only considering Rosh Chodesh and not other days. Okay, so Bez Hashem, tomorrow morning, I'll be seeing at 9 a.m. 9 a.m. tomorrow morning, the share will be. I'm going to put it out now in the chat, but 9 a.m. Zoom only. Have a great evening. Good, good to Thank you.